Another great feature in Canvas is the chat feature uh, that can be used in a couple of ways. It can be used as a back channel during your lesson. Uh, so if students have questions, they can um, ask those questions that either the teacher or another student could answer. Um, or it can be a way to solicit information from your students, whether they're remote or in person, um, into the class uh, without being in the chat in the Google Meet. And this way, all the students can be involved in the chat. So the first thing you'll need to do is it's probably going to be disabled in your navigation. So you're going to go to Settings. And from the Settings, you're going to click on the Navigation tab up here at the top. It will probably start out with Course Details. Click over to Navigation. Scroll down to the bottom. And in your list of, of uh, items that have been disabled, click the three dots at the far right and then select Enable. And it's going to move Chat now up into the Enabled list. And then you can click and drag and put this wherever you want it in your uh, list of items for your student. So I'm just going to put it here at the top and then make sure that you save that you've added Chat. So now I can see the Chat over here on the side. The wonderful thing about Chat is that you're going to notice when I click on it, it's going to bring up the chat that has already that is already going on and it's going to split it up by date and it's going to be ongoing as we go through the chat. So I want to show you I have here some students. So here is the student view. The student is in the chat and they're seeing what's going on as well as the teacher and it's going to do a couple of things. It's going to give the date that the information was entered in the chat. And then if you mouse over what the student has put in, it will give the time that they actually put that in the chat. You'll notice that if you go to an actual student over here at the far right as the teacher, you can actually delete a comment. So if something is put in inappropriate, the teacher does have control to do that. But if I go into my demo student account, when I go here as the student, I cannot delete what I've put in. So only the teacher controls what's in this chat as students are using it. So that's a, a very nice feature of this. Again, if you don't want this enabled uh, while uh, you're in between classes, then you can just go back to settings and if you disable the chat, it will move it to where it's disabled, save. And once I do that, the students are not going to see it in there. Let me go back to home here because I was just in there. It's not going to be where they can access it to add things into the chat. But when I open it back up as the teacher, everything that was in the chat, just a second, uh, everything that was in the chat will stay there. So nothing will be deleted. Um, I can go in and I can open that up and I'll be able to see exactly what was there. Nothing will go away. So again, another great feature of Chanva Canvas, a great way to use uh, as a back channel. It's also a great way to get students collaborating both between in-person and remote.